Windows Hello is a rather important service if you're looking to secure your PC, but it's not perfect. My name is Adullah, you're watching Candido Technology, and in this video, we're going to fix the Windows Hello pin currently unavailable error that you might see. So the first thing that I'm going to suggest to you is that you restart your computer. I know it sounds basic, I know it sounds frivolous, but just restart your PC just to make sure no corrupt processes or anything like that is running in the background and that you start with a fresh slate. If that does not fix your error, what we are going to do is uh, we're going to use the reset your pin option in Windows settings to try and reset your pin and force it back into action. To do this, press Windows key plus I to open the start menu and head over to accounts settings menu actually. Uh, in accounts, we're going to scroll down and click on sign in options. And here you'll see all of your sign in options available. Click on pin Windows Hello and you will see that there is a link called I forgot my pin. We're going to click on this and a small Microsoft window will appear. This window will let us reset our pin. So we're going to click continue. Wait a moment. It will ask you the password for your Microsoft account. You go ahead and you sign in and you can create a new Windows pin. Once, Once you're done, you can uh, come back to these settings and you should see the pin working in action. Another solution that you can try is to delete something called the NGC folder on your Windows drive. To do this, press Windows key plus E to open the Windows Explorer or you can just go to the start menu and search for Windows Explorer or File Explorer or whatever it's called these days. Once we're in here, I need you to go to this URL or link for the directory that I'll include in the description below. Just copy paste it in the upper box right here and press enter. In here, you should see a folder called NGC. Now, if this folder is empty on your PC, you can uh, go ahead and ignore this step and move on to the next one. But if it's not empty on your system, just double click to open the NGC folder and delete all of the files inside. Once you're done, you can close File Explorer, come back in, head back to Windows settings, click on accounts, then scroll down, click on sign in options, click on pin, and you should see the option of adding a new pin appear right here. If deleting the NGC folder did not work for you, the next step is to go ahead and uh, make a registry key change. Now to do this, what we're going to do is uh, press Windows key plus R to open the run prompt, type in regedit and click OK. It will ask you for some permissions and then your registry editor should be open. Now, once again, just like we did in the file explorer, I am going to need you to copy paste the path that I am providing in the comments below. So let me just come back here, select everything, clear it. And then as you can see, I will paste the new path in. Press enter and this should get you into this systems folder. Now, if you see that this systems folder is blank, what you're going to have to do is right click, hover on new, hover on D word 32 bit value. And I'm going to name this new D word as allow domain pin logon. Press enter to save it. Double click it to open properties. Make sure that the base is hexadecimal and set the value to one. Once you're done, go ahead and click OK to save your changes and then restart your PC. Once you are done, you should see the add pin option show up back in the Windows settings. If none of these settings have worked for you so far, what you can try is creating another administrator account and adjusting the pin settings there. Now this, it does not really fix the problem on the first account and it's more of a workaround, but it should work fine for you. So go ahead and press Windows key plus I to open Windows settings. And here, once again, we're going to the accounts option. Now scroll all the way down until you see this other users setting. Click on it. And now as you can see, you can go ahead and add an account to your PC. I'm going to go ahead and click on add account. Now uh, it will ask you how will this person sign in. I recommend that you say uh, select this option that says I don't have this person sign in information. And then click on add a user without a Microsoft account. Now simply 
enter a username and a password and then click next this will make a new administrator account once you're done with that you can go ahead and log in via the new account to try and set up a pin for your pc finally if nothing else works your best bet is to go ahead and reset windows how to do that well press windows key plus i to open windows settings once again and this time we're going to the system option and here from this list scroll down until you see recovery in recovery you will see a bunch of options but what we are interested in is reset this pc go ahead and click on the reset pc button and follow the instructions that come on the screen once the reset is complete you should be able to get your windows up and running without any problems including your windows hello pin settings if you like this video consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such content can we make for you if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and we'll see you in the next video